Sisi tumepambana na mambo ya kugawa kiharu na hatutarudi nyuma. Hata ile commission mpya ikikuja bunge mwezi huu ama mwezi mwingine tutawaambia wakiangalia mambo ya mipaka tena. Ni vizuri tuangalie pali haki inatakiwa kuwa. Na kiharu inatakiwa kukatwa iwe mara mbili. Manake wakati tunagawa pesa ya mashinani, kiharu inaumia. Manake ukiangalia mathioya, uangalie kangema, zote mbili ni ndogo kuliko kiharu. Wananchi ambao wako kwa constituency hizo mbili pia ni wadogo kuliko kiharu. Lakini wanagawa CDF mbili na kiharu inagawa mo? moja. Kwa hivyo ni vizuri tuangalie mambo ya haki na pahali haki inatakiwa kuwa na ndio hata tulipigania tukakuwa na district ama wilaya ya pili ikaitwa Kahuro. Manake tunajua ya kwamba kiharu ni kubwa sana. Kwa hivyo hiyo hiyo msiwe na shaka nimekusikiliza mchungaji and anything that is fair to our country i will always speak about it the second thing i want to speak about mimi nataka kuwarudishia asanteni mawaziri wawili ambao niliwaona jana mheshimiwa haji na mheshimiwa saitoti kwa mambo ambayo wanatekeleza katika mpaka wetu na somalia we must ensure we protect our people at whatever cost. And therefore I want to commend our defense forces for what they have done in the last one week. And I want to say that the issue of security is not negotiable. And we must do what it takes to ensure all our borders are secure. Vile vile naye commissioner wa police ataka kumwambia tutampatia support yale ambayo tuliona na Robi ya kwamba askari wako tayari kupambana na wakora ni lazima ifanyike kila pahali nchini because we need Kenyans who are secure from wherever they are Kenyans must feel secure within our borders they must feel secure inside Kenya jambo la tatu nimemmsikiliza vika jendro na mchungaji na mambo ya Ukristo Tulipokuwa tunakuja kuambia tupigie katiba kura Tulikuwa tumejua Wakristo wanataka nini na ndio wengi Na Wakristo walisema tafadhalini tusifanye uchaguzi wakati wa Christmas Na tukakubali kwa vile kulikuwa na representation mingi sana na ndiyo tukaweka siku ya uchaguzi iwe mwezi wa nane. Mimi nimekuwa mstari wa kwanza, nilikuwa mwanasiasa wa kwanza kusema ni lazima uchaguzi ufanywe mwezi wa nane. Nataka kuuliza ndugu zangu hapa, Mheshimiwa Mathioya na Mheshimiwa Kiharu. Tafadhalini tukirudi bunge, tusikubali kubadilisha katiba ati uchaguzi urudishwe Christmas Tufanye vile tuliambia wananchi wana wote ya kwamba uchaguzi utakuwa mwezi wa na wa nane. You do not amend the constitution to suit institutions You reform the institutions to suit the constitution So we must reform our institutions to suit the constitution but we will look very selfish as members of parliament if the first amendment to the constitution is to amend the date of the, of the elections. And we must therefore try to talk as Kenyans to seme ya kwamba uchaguzi tulisema ni mwezi wa nane, nyinyi muwe tiari, mimi niko tiari, tufanya uchaguzi mwezi wa na, wa nane. Sindio na mna iyo? Hivyo ndivyo tulisema. So let us stick to our covenant with the people on the constitution mambo ya inchi siasa ni mingi sitai kuzungumzia siasa leo lakini wale ambao wanataka kuongoza inchi yetu wote tuwekwe kwa ratili sote tuwekwe kwa ratili 
muangalie yale yote tumefanya kutoka wakati tulianza kazi. Nyadhifa ambao tumekuwa nazo, maeneo yetu ya bunge ambao tumewakilisha ili tusije tukachagua mtu aongoze nchi ambaye ni eneo kubwa na ile eneo lake ndogo ameshi ameshindwa we must evaluate all forms of leadership because as a majority you must define the kind of leadership you want that is what will help kenya to be held accountable and let us look for leadership that has ability vision passion and energy those are four very critical things that will build our country viongozi wezangu wamezungumzia shida ambazo ziko nchini mambo ya ajira ya vijana mambo ya chakula na kwa hivyo tunataka uongozi ambao utaweza kutatua shida hizo lakini tukichagua uongozi kwa sababu ya fulani ni fulani na fulani na tujui kazi ambayo inaweza fanyika kutakuwa na shida this country belongs to all of us inchi hii ni yetu sote kwa hivyo ni lazima tuangalie yule ambaye ataongoza nchi yule ambaye atakuwa pale kwa laini ya kwanza tunaweka kwa ratili hata mimi mwenyewe muniweke kwa rati kwa ratili manake hivyo ndivyo tunaweza linganisha uongozi bora kabisa